Welcome back, everyone, to a new episode of Starbound. I did some preparations, and we will head to the boss fight soon. We have some new pets. Come, show yourself. Well, maybe later. Yeah, I'm pretty much prepared. I don't have too much food left, but... It shouldn't be necessary. There's something in the 3D printer I found. And I think this boss fight will be funny. You will see what I'm talking about when we are there. Just a little bit over to the left. I hope this works as I imagine. <laughs> yeah. Gun turrets. Gun turrets everywhere. They are so cheap, they only cost... What do they cost? One, one pixel. One pixel each. I just bought 1000 of them and placed... Yes, yeah, so in this arena there are pretty much around 100 of these auto gun turrets placed. I should have built the arena somewhere else, not above the avian village down here, because the, the frame rate isn't the best and I hope it won't be too bad. The turrets alone are no problem. If we jump up here on one side, you see frame rate is okay. But the avians down here, I fought some of them just to yeah, minimize what have to be what has to be calculated. Oh, and before we start, we found some new guns. We found the beefinator. It's a pistol, one-handed. And the other one-handed gun we found, we found the la last time, I haven't tried it and I didn't read the description very well. So when I used it I was quite surprised that it was a shot like this. Boop. You know, a pretty tired shot. But then I saw it's a grenade launcher. It's a one-handed grenade launcher and we have a one-handed gun over here. So what we could do is we could... Let's try this. We could place this here and we could place this here. And now we actually... Yeah. <laughs> we could dual wild with guns now. But we don't have so much energy. That's why I will keep the pistol in here. And has the highest DPS of all the guns. The assault rifle is nice. Yeah, actually, they are all not too bad. But uh, the pistol is the one with the highest DPS. So, here's the peanut butter trap. <laughs> oh man. Okay. Let's see what happens. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Okay. <laughs> Come on, turrets! I will help a bit. Oh, one turret broke. Yeah, that's how you fight a boss. Oh, oh no! Uh, but where where is the boss head? Oh, he's over here. Hey then, you wanna have a electro grenade? Grenade? Uh, 
doesn't do too much. The throwing needles. And now the throwing stars. Yeah, he's still alive. The turrets don't shoot him anymore. <laughs> that... That was a great boss fight. I like it. Okay, so the turrets are really, really great. I love the turrets. So, when we build a new base, I definitely know what I will add as base defense. These turrets, man. If they keep... If, if the price will stay at one pixel for each, that, that's way too cheap. One pixel for each is way too cheap. When you break them, you get um, a circuit board and a laser diet. You can also craft the circuit board and the laser diet and I think you are also able to craft the turrets by yourself. But there's no need to craft the turrets if you just can hit them for one pixel. One pixel is nothing for what they do. They are really, really fun. <laughs> That was a great boss fight. Okay, let's head back to the ship and build our new star map upgrade. All right, let's do the head to the planetary system behind the sun. And we will take a small desert. And up we go. Yeah, we are traveling to a new planet, guys. A new planet. So, we are here on the planet and I figured out we need some kind of new or EG salt or AG salt. And then we can build cannibal stuff so let's look what we find oh, this may already be it oh no it's uranium Pink stuff. Is that it? Plutonium. Okay. Oh. Oh no, they take like no damage. I think I'm running. <laughs> this is also uranium. I wonder if this is a new building material or if we can use it as fuel. What's this? I don't know this stuff. Cerulean. Okay. This is 
no comparison. Ouch. Okay, I have the feeling we are on the wrong planet. Let's look for a let's look for a planet that's not so dangerous. We are here. Yeah, threat level eight. And I think the threat level is indicating the level the planet overall. So what do we need? Threat level five should be should be good. Let's head there. So let's check what happens when we smelt plutonium. Plutonium rod. Okay, okay, that's enough. And the uranium. Yeah, it's the same. Okay. We will try to use that this these two as fuel. Two of them would give me twelve. So one gives six fuel. This gives me eight. So four per piece. So coal two, four, six. And the raw stuff? Well, I bet it will give me half as much as the rest. So let's just fuel up everything. Ah, this is different color. This looks like... Yeah, it is AG salt. Okay, so we are looking for the light green stuff. something different or does it yeah it looks yellow on green soil hey you guys that's not what I wanted hmm Another one. Oh. This is one of the tech chest buildings, I guess. We have to be very careful when we want to infiltrate it. to be more careful. Here's your chance for revenge. Died instantly. Ooh, I'm about to die too. Paddle Roaster is entering the building.
you are friendly as well. USCM. So this is not an apex building. Uh, I thought this would be one of the facilities where I can get a tech chest, but probably not. I will learn all the things you have to teach me. Go in there, fight! <laughs> Attack them! Good boy! Good boy! another one of those you can shoot when you have to move Need the bench no. down again attack it good boy but you have no chance against the droid Oh no, me neither. Huh. You can't do anything about me now, can you? Too bad. Oh, this guy can shoot. Yeah, he's no, I don't want to die. I want to rescue my friend. The exploring of this planet is over. We brought some of the local animals back up here and now we are looking for another level 5 planet to get more EG salt. And ideally we will find a level 5 desert. It could take a while until we find something like that, so I will skip ahead to that. Here we have a desert level 5, a tundra level 6, so if we get enough EG salt from here, we may be able to head to this one next and there's an arid biome level 7 and an asteroid field level 7 and they are, there are uh, more planets around the sun so this is a pretty good system we will head to this desert first hey guys it's getting pretty crowded in here don't jump on my head I'm trying to sleep hey hey you too wait that's, that's uh, just not really acceptable you, you come all get all up here you can't you're too big okay well since I can't keep you out of bed just stay calm let me sleep as much as I can look what we have here a grenade launcher with a um, weapon effect okay. we will test it on an enemy if we see one yeah there are one. there are some Huh. It's not bad. Foop. Oh no, too short. Oh, by the way, what I wanted to show you is... You see? I'm underwater. Oh, what was that? 
I'm underwater and surely I can't breathe underwater. But what I can do is, if I pack on my survival system, I can actually breathe underwater. So, if you didn't know, it's not just good for space exploration, it's, it's also good for underwater exploration. <laughs> he has a flaming tongue. Oh no, 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 no! Oh, that's close! That's close! That's even closer than I realized. Phew. Okay. Good. I need to make more of these hot bones. I like food that heals you and makes you fast. <laughs> you see this little dagger here? It has an attack speed, a swing speed of 4.05. Look at this. Chop, 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 chop. Maybe we should try this one out just, just for fun. There should be a guard left somewhere around here. Come on, guard! I know you have to be here. Oh, actually, two guards. Yeah, this is not a bad dagger. Let's see how well this works. Okay, he's still charging through this attacks. It's so fast! Ooh, that was close. All right, we are back on our ship, and now we will smelt all the EG salt we found. Okay, the majority of the EG salt bars are ready. Let's see what we can build here. This one-handed. Is this my hammer? My Beloved hammer weapon. And the two handed sword isn't better than this, but the hammer actually is nice. EG Sword tech upgrade. Yeah, sure. Yeah, that's way better. Okay, so craft the mask, craft the pants, and craft the chest guard. Now let's see how freaky we look. Oh yeah, we re look really freaky. Hey, 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 hey. Come to me, I wanna eat you. I wanna eat you. <laughs> we still have 56 EG salt bars to spend on something. We could build a furnace. Oh no, wait, before we do anything. New blueprints have been unlocked. Ferrosium. Oh, that's nice. Smashy tree. Really? <laughs> I want to fight with a tree. Okay, Ferrosium. Oh, that's convenient. Craft the Ferrosium stuff. And now the Smashy tree. Well, if I would have known that the next year is, I guess it's always you find a new ore or you use a new ore and then the next level is the same ore with coal. Yeah, look at that. That's great. <laughs> okay, that was all the ferrosium bars I have. Can I do a... Yeah, there are even more armor options. Oh no, I don't have enough for them. Yeah, I m 
might have 55. I do have enough for them. Okay, so we skipped this cannibal tier pretty much. And we will wear the Ferrosium. Wise man's loincloth, a thinking head, and the chest guard. Yeah, our health and energy definitely drops when we take off our armor and put it back on. So we are. are the armor value here is. <laughs> the new weapon is, is really great. A tree. I'm punching with a tree. Okay. I have to test this. Even though this is just a tier 5 planet or a threat level 5 planet. Oh yeah. You used to be a threat. Now let's see. Hit me. Hit me. Hmm. Yeah, okay. They don't hurt so much anymore. Okay, so we for the big three blob jelly alien tentacle boss with our array of gun turrets. We <laughs> Yeah, we found some we couldn't use or we can't use right now the cerulean and we found the EG salt and actually jumped right over the EG salt stuff and now have the ferrosium stuff so if we were on threat level 5 and gathered the EG salt there then the ferrosium stuff should be an accomplished level 6 so we should find our next or on threat level 7 so let's go th let's go to a threat level 7 planet yeah but this will be the end of the episode we will check out the other tiers in the next one when there is a next one I'm not sure when exactly the update will come and uh, when it's necessary to start a new character but I will try to get as far as I can with the pedal roaster. Oh, he's he has so much health. It takes ages. To regenerate it. Let's see if I can do I have enough ferrosium? Oh wait, I should be... There should be... Ferrosium tech upgrade. No, I still need more ferrosium because I have to build the tech upgrade. Yeah, I thought I forgot something. Okay, but that's something for the next episode. Yeah, alright. Then, until next time. I hope you enjoyed the video. Leave a like if you liked it. And subscribe for more Starbound action. See you next time.